We are Luke and Heather Bell, and we have eight children. Seven of them are adopted, and we are a family of 10, and this is Live in Large. So I waited till the last minute to um, make dinner. So whenever you aren't prepared, the fallback is what? What's the fallback for dinner, Izzy, when they, you don't prepare for dinner? Spaghetti. I actually don't even hardly make spaghetti. Oh, it's kind God. of like, it's, it's like my go-to whenever I, I just been feeling really lazy lately, I guess. And so I'm gonna make spaghetti and I got my meat in the microwave. So you know what? I don't always have everything prepared like right now. I don't have everything prepared. It's a quarter to four and I'm making spaghetti. <laughs> yeah, but the meat's not thawed out, so I can't even do meatloaf. So I'm just gonna put my spaghetti together. I'll try and soup up the sauce a little bit. And uh, your dog's freaking out. She just loves you so much. Okay, come show it to him. So Izzy found this noodle in the pack. Okay, it's rounded at the top. It's kind of cool. And my kids really like noodles, so if we Don't have, break the I won't put it over there then. No, no, put it over there. Oh, noodles are flying. So my kids really like noodles. So even if we don't eat all these noodles, they like to put butter, Parmesan cheese on it, and then just like eat it. I actually really like it like that too. But I get these um, high fiber ones, and then I found these Garden Delight veggie ones. It says they have, so it's simoleon wheat, carrot, tomato, spinach, niacin, iron, and then these have the high fiber, so we really try and eat. So it's high fiber, high protein. There's still a lot of carbs in it, but. All right, so Josh gets off at 5.30. Who's gonna get him today? All right, and I like to burn this, so I just gotta fill this with water. I'm gonna run over to my hand sink and do it. get these noodles going. I got a meeting at four. So let's get these going. My stove is a mess. I've got to clean my stove. All right, we got that going. So I got my meat in the microwave. <laughs> here, let's bring the camera over here. I got the meat in the microwave and um, I grab my garlic. I'll put some spices in it. Then I have, um, I don't think I have oregano over there, but I got basil at a time. So let me get some sauces here and then we're gonna grab some herbs off of here. So I'm gonna move you guys over here to my food pantry. All right, so it looks like we're gonna have to head downstairs. So we're gonna head downstairs, sorry about that. Okay, so I have a food pantry downstairs. It's kind of like I just don't have room up here, which is really weird. So I put my food pantry in the basement and um, it's like a grocery store, like a mini grocery store. And I know I've showed everybody it and my downstairs is kind of messy. So I do apologize. You guys are gonna be like, holy cow, she's messy. So I need about four sauces. I, I wish I had a bag here. You know what? I do have this. So let me, let me move this. I'm gonna take these glasses out of here. I should have brought like a little garbage bag. So this is kind of our storage area where we put all like our seasonal stuff. I'm a little behind right now. My kids keep buying new beds. And so because they keep buying new beds, um, I have all these bed frames and everything. Okay. I'll get a diced tomato and a fire roasted tomato. And here I can kind of show you here what I'm doing. I get my sauces. All right. And I'm probably going to need three. Let me see here. So I just got, can you guys see all that? Those are beans. I try and be organized. I think I'll do a, a tomato paste just to make it a little thick. Because I'm going to add spice. Okay, that should be good. All right, so that should be good. Now I'm going to put you down for a second. 
And so I gotta get the doors closed and everything. So we're gonna have some ready to go. All right, here we go. So I guess we're supposed, you guys are gonna see up my nose here for a second. All right. I got my little container that I'm putting everything in. You guys are thinking like, holy cow, she's crazy. Hopefully I don't got nothing in my nose. All right, here we go. Let's get you guys back in here. So I guess I could have taken the whole stand, whatever. So my kids just informed me that, um, that doesn't sound good. They informed me that, um, we're expected to get, I'm a little crooked there, uh, 20 inches of snow, 20 inches of snow, 20 inches of snow. All right, so I got uh, fire roasted tomatoes. These are fire roasted. These are just roasted garlic. I got my, look at that. You can never find tomato paste this big, and look at this. I don't even know where I found it. And my, I like to get the um, no sugar added uh, tomato sauces. You know, you're gonna have sugar in things, but I try and do the least sugar as possible. So we're gonna grind our hamburger up. And that's in the microwave right now. I know I keep looking over there because I'm so used to like having it vertical or horizontal, vertical. And so I keep forgetting you gotta look at the green dot. That's why I tell my kids, look at the green dot when I take a picture. So Josh is working today and we have to get him at 5.30. I'm just gonna open this up here. And I like to use garlic. My husband's like, yeah, you know, I, I know that you use a lot of garlic, but when you open it, it like really smells really nice. So I'm gonna use minced onion. I got some fresh herbs from my herb garden that Joshie made me. And if you guys subscribe to us, can you share it with other people? Cause I'm really having a hard time getting our page going. All right. So I have some fresh herbs over here we're gonna work with, but I'm gonna grab um, some spices. I'm gonna come over here and this is kind of where my spices are. So I'm gonna get some oregano because I, I have to actually find, I don't have any oregano plants, so I actually have to find some oregano. I guess they're gonna start having more herbs as like the season continues. And then I'm gonna do minced onion. All right, so I got these for dried. And then I'm going to grab my, let's see here, my herbs. So here, I'm gonna let you guys see me cut them for the very first time. Kids, so I have basil here. Cut some basil. And then that's mint. And this is thyme, so I'm gonna do some thyme here. Mmm, right. smell that. <laughs> Alright, so I got my fresh herbs. I'm super excited. I might need a little bit more time. Okay. When you have fresh herbs, you don't have to use as much. So let me get us, I'm gonna flip you guys this way so you can see everything I'm doing here. I got my noodles going and I might start my sauce even though my meat's done so we're just gonna put the I'll bring it over here so you guys can see I'm gonna start the sauce and I'll just cook the hamburger and something else And then my two cans of fire roasted tomatoes. I mean, I know I'm using a prepared sauce, but I like to try and add like a little bit of homemade to it even when I don't. I like garlic. 
I like garlic. I know I keep looking to the side. You're like, who are you looking at? So my kids are supposed to be um, doing the boxes and I look outside and they're playing basketball. All right, oregano and some minced garlic. Got my noodles going. All right. Now, of course, my, my time. I'm so excited. And then my basil. Smells good. I might actually only need, boy, those herbs you guys smell so good. I don't know why I didn't have an herb garden sooner. Sheesh. And then I'll season my meat with the, I might do a little more oregano. I think I'll do some more spices too. I don't think I'm gonna need this one. So I'll keep out the oregano, the minced onion. and get these gone. the garlic. Let me stir that up. Actually, it looks pretty good. I definitely like to clean things as I go. Um, I try and do the dishes. I try and clean things up. Just kind of who I am, I guess. That looks not too bad. I'll add the meat to it and I'm gonna add a little bit more spices. Probably gonna over spice it, but I'm so excited to use my first herbs. It smells, oh, I can't even tell you how well this smells so beautiful. All right, I got a meeting at four, so I'm gonna have to finish this later after my meeting, but at least I got the sauce ready, the meat's thawing out. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do the meat, I'm gonna add garlic, minced onion, oregano, some more basil and thyme, grind that up, I'll probably add an onion, I'll chop up an onion, put that in there, and then uh, I'm gonna add it to my sauce. I should make a video cleaning my oven. <laughs> All right. So at least I'm prepped because in about probably 5.30, all my family's gonna be like, where's dinner? So I'm gonna grab an onion out too. I need a pan for doing the hamburger. Okay, so I'm gonna wait for that hamburger to thaw out and then I'm gonna come back and we're gonna finish the spaghetti. Okay, so I finally got my hamburger thawed out. That took forever. So I got my hamburger here. So I'm just gonna cook this up and then once it's done, I'm gonna add it to the spaghetti sauce. I love this chopper. It's one of those Pampers Chef choppers. Ooh, this is gross. I'm gonna stick this in the... Okay. So my noodles are done. I got the spaghetti sauce done. I'm gonna add some garlic, because I love garlic. I need to bring you guys a little closer, hey? And then minced onion. I never did chop up that onion. I'm just gonna use minced onion today. And my oregano. There we go. And I usually add a little bit of oil. Let me go grab some oil. So we raise our own animals and they don't have a lot of fat, like if you were to get them in the grocery store. 
So I like to add a little bit of good oil. I really love avocado oil. I actually switched from coconut oil because um, I had um, some blood work done and it showed that my cholesterol was kind of high, my triggs were kind of high, my HDL was kind of high, my bad, what is it lipids? I don't know. So um, they had suggested, I had was working with a nutritionist and he said to not do the coconut oil even though it's good for you. He said to try avocado oil or grapeseed oil. So eh, I like avocados. So I thought, well, we'll just do that. All right, there we go. Get that meat going. Okay, let me get my stuff put away. So I like the avocado oil. Let me put these up too. I just picked some more herbs. And there we go. Basil and thyme. So I got dried oregano, garlic. Let me use this. Dried oregano, garlic, basil. I'm gonna bring you guys over here so you can be a little closer. There you go. Let's let you see what I'm cooking. There we go. All right, so I got the hamburger almost done, but I didn't cook it all the way because it's still gonna cook in the sauce. All right, so just gotta put the garlic bread in and then, all right, let's warm this up here. Ah! Meat's falling everywhere. All right. Hey, Izzy, do you wanna come open up this, uh, these breads for me? The to you can just do the toast if you want. The other one can be later. Oh, yeah, sure. All right, I'm going to heat this up and then we're ready to go. Just put the <coughs> breads in there. Got food all over the ground. Oh, yeah, I've got Here, yeah, just put the bread in there. I'll get this heated up and then we'll be ready to eat. When did Jack leave? I don't know, I was upstairs. Well, I fell asleep at like... 1.30 and then I fell asleep on your friend. Well, he had to work. I fell asleep All right, so I'm going to have Izzy do the bread. I got the sauce almost done. And the noodles are already done. All right. The whole McGuire family's here. Right now? Mm -hmm. From the barn? Okay. They're coming to get food. They are? Yeah, hopefully you made enough. Okay, get the bread going. Let's go. Hustle, hustle, hustle. Look what you're making me do. You're just hustle. You know, everything you do How is so she slow. Do that? She's just really slow. All right, so I guess we have a family coming that I didn't know about, and so hopefully I had made enough. I don't know why you have a stupid nails on anyway. It just won't open. I asked you to help, so I wouldn't That's have to I'm do it. Like you're yeah, I'm hustling you because we have a family here that I didn't know was going to come over. So, you know, well, I guess we're going to need both breads, so get another pan out. Let's get this going. All right, I'm going to put this in right now. So, I need my towel back. All right, open that big bread up, too. All right, your dog is crazy. All right. Oh, my goodness, please. Yeah, just throw them in there. Perfect. And get the take care of your garbage. All right, got oh, that yeah. in. Okay, so we have the bread going. The sauce is all ready to go. Um, we have people coming over, so I have to kind of. My house is destroyed. Did you see them over there? Yes. Yeah, oh, okay. All right. All right. Oh, yep. You're right. They are. They come in this way. All right. Well, here's my spaghetti. Yeah, they are. I'm going to. Are they walking over? Yeah. Huh? So I'm just going to plate it up so you can actually see it, and then I got to go. It's not the whole family. It's just two of them. The whole family's there. 
Give it a look at the horse. Okay, so here we go. Spaghetti. Oh, we don't want to see you TikTok and walk walk. This isn't TikToking. I'm not TikToking. Where's it gonna go? TikTok. This is a YouTube. Okay. Here we go. Dinner is served. 